I own this laundromat. Let's see how much money it made in the past 10 days. These are my smallest machines. They can do 20 pounds of laundry. I charge $4 and have about 15 of them. Next up is my second smallest. They can do up to 30 pounds. I charge $5 and I have 14 of them. Then we have my bigger machines. They can do up to 40 pounds of laundry. I have two of them and charge $6. And then last but not least, we have the big kahunas. They can do up to 60 pounds of laundry. I charge $7.50 and people love them. My dryers are all the same. They can do up to 30 pounds of laundry and I have 14 double stacks for a total of 28 dryers. After I'm done with the quarters, I go in for the cash. Here's the first one. And then here's the second one. A little smaller because I had to make change for the register. And that's what 10 days worth of cash looks like. Now let's check out the vending machines. I buy each box for 50 to 60 cents each and sell them for $1.25. This machine is by far my best seller. I order everything online and my manager stocks it, so it's pretty passive. Can't beat it. When I'm done with this one, it's time to check out the pop machine. I buy each can for 50 to 60 cents each and sell them for a dollar. With the exception of water, which I get for about 20 cents each. Here's the cash, and then down low we have the quarters. The quarters don't look too hot, but the cash is pretty decent because it's been getting warmer lately. And then on to the snack machine. It was pretty empty for a while, so I'm not expecting too much on this one. Here's the cash, which is pretty pitiful. And then we have the quarters. Let's take everything in the office and count it up, starting with the snack machine. Here are the dollars. Came out to 41. And then we have the quarters. I weigh them. It comes out to $20 per pound, minus the bucket. I'll add everything together and show you what it came out to at the end. Here's the cash from the pot machine. This time it came out to $73, which is pretty damn good. And then here are the quarters. And then last but definitely not least, we have the soap machine money. Came out to about $200. And then finally, we have the washers and dryers that came in at around $2,900. Now let's count up all the cash that we got from the change machine and see how much it came out to. My laundromat also accepts debit and credit, so I'll be adding those numbers to the total at the very end. At my laundromat, we also have a wash and fold service where we do people's laundry for them and charge them by the pound. It's a huge part of my business, so I use a software called Curbside Laundries to keep everything organized and track everything. I'll tag them if you want to check them out. So here's how much the cash came out to, and then here's how much money my laundromat made in total in the past 10 days. Let me know if you have any questions.